In this lesson, we will see how we can set up Win Automation with Microsoft Power Automate. Win Automation is an official Power Automate plugin and it's an RPA tool. That means that we can do all sorts of UI operations, clicking around in applications, browsers, scraping data and all that. Let's see how it's done. First, we will download. So click download. Then you will scroll a little bit down and click download Win Automation. That's it. We can see that our download started here. While we do that, we need to purchase the plugin. It's quite cheap, so click purchase. The pricing. We will need to have the per user plan with attended RPA here. So we will click buy now. It's $40 a month. That's very cheap compared to other RPA tools. And click just me if you are just you. It will take you to this side and you can see that I already signed in. So I'll just click continue because yeah, that's me. And now the price will come up in my local currency. So that's $40 in Danish kronos. That is probably around this plus taxes. That's fine. Then I click place order. They are processing my order. And that's it. Now we can click the installation file here. We will run it to set up win automation. And in a few seconds, we are already set up and we can start doing real RPA in Power Automate. We'll just take the default settings. We can see here that the license type, select the type of license you wish to use. We have uh, now purchased uh, a Microsoft Power Automate license. So that's how this is the license that we want to use. And we can have some browser extensions. Well, I like all because we want to automate in all sorts of browsers as our process, process description uh, dictates. So let's just click next, next, and we'll start installing. That's it. You can see up here that um, we can enable the extension. That will one we will have to do whenever we open all the browsers, but let's just do it here in Chrome. So we'll enable it. And that's it. So now we have enabled soft emotive automation, that is win automation. And we can also see that we have opened up uh, Firefox. So we we'll click add here. Okay, got it. That's it. We can close it down. And we have Edge here as well. So now we have our extensions in all the browsers. That's fine. Now we can go to our Microsoft Office Home. Then we can click Admin. Like this. Then we click Users. We click Active Users. And you can see your user here in your Admin Center. Mine is this one. So what I do here is that I click the three dots and then manage product licenses. Then I can find my uh, Power Automate with attended RPA over here. So I'll take this one and then I'll click save changes. It will save and now we can log in with our Win Automation. Now go to your start here, search for Win Automation console, click it. That's it. Now we can start creating some Win Automation RPA within Power Automate. If you want more tutorials on Microsoft Power Automate, click the video to the left. And if you want to get started with Win Automation, then click the video on the right. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel to get all the new Power Automate and Win Automation videos coming up.